Good morning, everybody. Welcome to today's devotion for July 5th. Today's devotion is titled Mimic Jesus, and the Bible reading is from Romans chapter 12, verses 1 to 8. Therefore, I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's mercy, to offer your bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to God. This is your true and proper worship. Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, his good, pleasing, and perfect will. For by the grace given me, I say to every one of you, every one of you do not think of yourself more highly than you ought, but rather think of yourself with sober judgment in accordance with the faith God has distributed to each of you. For just as each of us has one body with many members, and these members do not all have the same function, so in Christ we, though many, form one body, and each member belongs to all the others. We have different gifts according to the grace given to each of us. If your gift is prophesying, then prophesy in accordance with your faith. If it is serving, then serve. If it is teaching, then teach. If it is to encourage, then give encouragement. If it is giving, then give generously. If it is to lead, do it diligently. If it is to show mercy, do it cheerfully. A master of disguise lives in the waters of Indonesia and in the Great Barrier Reef. The mimic octopus, like other octopuses, can change its skin pigment to blend in with its surroundings. This intelligent creature also change, changes its shape, movement, movement pattern, and behavior when threatened, to, when threatened to mimic such creatures as the venomous lionfish and even deadly sea snakes. Unlike the mimic octopus, Believers in Jesus are meant to stand out in the world that surround us. We may feel threatened by those who disagree with us and become tempted to blend in so we won't be recognized as followers of Christ. The Apostle Paul, however, urges us to offer our bodies as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to God, representing Jesus in every aspect of our lives. Friends or family members may try to pressure us to conform to the pattern of this world, but we, can only, but we can show who we serve by aligning our lives with what we say we believe as God's children. When we obey the scriptures and reflect his loving character, our lives can demonstrate that the rewards of obedience are always greater than any loss. How will you mimic Jesus today? When have you been tempted to become an unrecognizable believer in Jesus? When have you become alienated from family members or friends because you chose to represent Jesus through your words and actions? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.